Belgian filled double chasing Jair's take on Hearts in the final game of the season. Celtic secured the league title last week which brings yet another year of misery to my life. Hopefully we end the season with a win so without a further to do. Let's -a go! The Hearts defender crumbles under pressure and gets tackled by McCausland who passes to Dessers who fucks it up as usual and keeps the scores nil nil after missing from three yards out. <laughs> One of the Japanese players plays a through ball which misses our whole defense before our new signing Lawrence Shankland puts the jam tarts 1-0 up. At this rate we are getting pumped in the final. Ross McCausland flicks the ball over one of the Hearts players heads. Sends another one to Greggs before absolutely smacking the ball into the far corner from about 25 yards out. He is a Neymar gen. Mark my words. Tavernier plays an inch-perfect pass to Dessers who plays the ball to Cantwell first time before he takes a touch and smashes it into the far corner to make the game 2-1 to Rangers. What a turnaround. McCausland passes the ball into the box before Silva surprisingly doesn't dive in the box and scores a goal which should finally see the game off with a Rangers win and no questions should be asked. If we lose this game I might genuinely cancel my season ticket. A Hearts player crosses the ball into the box before another one is able to get on the end of it and score to send about 12 Hearts fans into celebration and turn the comeback on. The ball gets headed down to one of the Japanese chaps who send a thunder cunt into the back of the net securing a 3-3 draw with the last kick of the season for Rangers. Of course we have only gone and bottled it like the end of last season. The full-time whistle ends a disappointing league season and gives fans more worry ahead of the Scottish Cup final. Let's just hope we can win the cup and at least not bottle it like today.